bear snot or spit bug spittle. When I was a kid, we thought this stuff was bear snot. Uh, when in fact later we found out years later that it was actually produced by a spit bug and it was spit bug spittle. Here's an example, good examples of what spit bugs do. Lots of spittle here. Look at all that spittle. Wow. Spit bug spittle. Lots of it. All that white stuff. Produced by spit bugs. And presumably inside is, I don't want to touch it with my bare hands, but there should be a spit bug or a spittle bug in there. But all this whole area is covered in spittle from spit bugs. Pretty cool. And we're right behind the beaver dam. So lots of moisture for the spit bugs. Here's the spit bug and its spittle. The spittle is a protective nest that the spit bug puts around it so that it can avoid predators. And uh, here's another spit bug inside its spittle nest. And another spit bug. So it's a small bug, produces uh, spit, which is actually produced from its anus, but uh, it is a protective mechanism to avoid being eaten. By Gary J. Ordog, MD. Medical toxicology. So try not to touch the spittle uh, and it is not bear snot. So thank you for all your kind support. Don't touch the bear snot. Uh, recommended advice from this video. Uh, please subscribe to my free channel. Press the small caricature below and please uh, stay safe and have a good life over and out